Chapter Two. Fix looks at Passepartout. Where are you going? He asks. Around the world, says Passepartout. But right now, I need some new shirts. Fix takes him to a shop, and leaves him there. Then, he sends a telegram to London. The gentleman thief is going to Bombay. Stop. From Fix. Later, he gets on the ship for Bombay, with fog, and Passepartout. It is the twentieth of October. They all arrive in Bombay two days early. At four thirty in the afternoon, fog and Passepartout leave the ship. They want to get a train across India to Calcutta. It leaves. At eight o'clock. First, Fogg goes to the passport office. Then he eats at the station. Passepartout visits the temple at Malabar Hill, but he doesn't take off his shoes. Visitors must remove their shoes. The priests get angry. They take his shoes, and Passepartout runs away. Fog and Passepartout get on the train, but Fix. Stays in Bombay. He is waiting for a telegram from London. After three days, the train stops. The railway from Kolbe to Allahabad isn't ready. Some men are building the railway, but there are eighty kilometers without a railway between Kolbe and Allahabad. In Colby, Passepartout gets some new shoes. He also finds an elephant to take them to a lullabad. They stop near a temple in the village of Pillaji. The old Indian prince is dead. His young wife. The princess must die with him in a big fire. We must help that woman," says Fog. The priests start the fire. Through the smoke, Fog sees something beautiful. The prince stands up. And takes the princess out of the fire. The prince and the princess come nearer. 
fog sees that the man is not the prince. It is Passepartout in the prince's clothes. Quickly, let's go, says Passepartout to Fog, quietly. Suddenly, the priests see the prince's body on the fire. They see that the man in the prince's clothes is not the prince, and they become angry. Fog, Passepartout, and the princess leave very quickly on the elephant. Elephant.